Welcome to Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Steve Mum. I am delighted to be on location at Riverfront Park. You probably recognize the Ice Palace behind me. We have, uh, of course, Dale Larson here from Riverfront Park. Thank you so much, Dale. Welcome, welcome. You are the expert tour guide. Now, who do we have on the ice behind us right now? Oh, we, we have our parent and taught lessons. So these are little people and their and their parents and such, and it's, it's part of our, our skate lesson program. Yeah, and they're swinging developed. some hockey sticks. You bet. And you, you bet. know the great thing I see, we've got boys and girls out there. A little mix, just like, you know, our, our rental skates. I, I, I have to show you these. Look at this. This is like something you would hang on your mirror. But we <laughs> yeah. have a, we have a, here at the Riverfront Park Ice Palace, we have a great uh, rental uh, inventory. Everything so you're from, saying anybody who comes down, it, you got to skate. Yeah, there you no, go. No, no, there there we go. No, that's uh, a big one. That's a, that's a more yeah. gripping skate there. It is. But mm. you know, the Riverfront Park Ice Palace is one of the main attractions during this time of year. And uh, a nationally recognized one. Yeah. I need to share the good news. Well, a, a number of years ago in yeah. USA Today, uh, the Ice Palace was voted uh, one of the top 10 outdoor ice rinks in the United States. And, and it's just a beautiful place. And I've actually spent some time out there skating over the years. I, I think everyone should at least yeah. uh, come down and give this a shot. But anyway, so this is just one of the many things going on here. Give us the give us the list of what's up for the holiday season. People are looking for things to do over the holidays with their families. Well, over the holidays, of course, we'll have the Ice Palace open. Uh, the the Loof Carousel will be open. That always keeps you young, you know, maybe a, a ride or two on that. And that is, uh, that's a work of art. That's more than just a carousel. It, it really is. They're hand-carved wooden uh, figures on it. Uh, really, it's been rated as one of the top three in North America. We, we keep great care of it. I mean, we, we It's do. just beautiful. It is. Yeah. And of course, you know, the river down here this time of year, it's flowing very nice. And we have our Spokane Falls Sky Ride. They'll take you right over the lower falls. And then we have our IMAX Theater, where we have a couple Hollywood features playing. We've brought back the Polar Express for the holidays, which is magnificent on the giant screen. It's funny when our producer heard that. She goes, I want to go. I want to oh, go. She's, she's the same age as me, but yes, kids of all ages. It's so good. And then we have an action-packed uh, uh, Hollywood feature called Real Steel, which will also be playing. But then the day after Christmas, we're going to bring in Happy Feet, too. <laughs> you know, I feel better already, too, you know, just knowing that's coming. You know, the one thing about Riverfront is we do try to make it affordable for the family. So during the holidays, we're, we've, we're going to offer a $14 holiday package. Give it as a gift, give it to yourself, then you can go ice skate and go to the IMAX, ride the carousel, you know, just enjoy the full uh, day of activities at Riverfront. Oh, and, and it is just beautiful. You know, you were talking about the river. A, a lot of cities do not have any kind of river running through the middle Correct. of it. Correct. Let Correct. alone one this beautiful. I, I had to park across the street. I didn't have to. I did it park across the street. Sure, sure. Walked across the river, and I thought, wow, it's truly magnificent. That's, you know... I think what people forget is that just coming down to Riverfront Park, centrally located, close, affordable parking, a walk in the park it is great. And Spokane is fortunate to have this facility. Oh, and it's amazing. You know, I've lived here a very long time, born and raised. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, before Expo 74, it was kind of skid road and a Oh, absolutely. Yards. I mean, what a transformation. You know, speaking of that, it probably is a big job. This is a big, sprawling complex. This is to keep keep up things up around here. Correct, correct. But you know, it's a team effort. Uh, as the events coordinator, I help some things happen, but we have maintenance, we have operations, security. Um, it is a team effort in all ways, shapes, and forms. And of course, being part of the City of Spokane Parks and Recreation Department, we have that team at City Hall uh, uh, supporting us too, along with a great park board. So yeah, it all well, filters all down. It all filters down to just having some fun. Yeah, and that's great. <laughs> it's great that you put together some of those affordable packages for the holidays. Kids yeah. are going to be out of school, and they're going to be talking to mom and dad, driving them crazy. So Dale, we just have a quick 30 seconds left, but you got some great packages again. Make it very easy for families and affordable. Talk about that a little. Absolutely. We, we have a group sales department that if you have a company uh, or a family gathering, they can help you out, uh, get, get the best deals. We have birthday party packages. One thing I didn't mention is that we have indoor heated seating. Oh, okay. what a plus. Now, where was that again? Oh, it's just right over okay. here. <laughs> Dale, good call. Thanks for joining us today. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Steve Mum. You're watching Comcast Newsmakers. Stay tuned. CNN, headline news, top of the hour.